Hello, it's Friday. It's um, light outside still, so the children are coming back from school and starting to scream in the streets, which is interesting. And good to see that children actually still do come out into the open spaces. Um, Friday night fantasy. Well, that's an interesting question for me because um, a lot of people would, would possibly say that um, I live in a fantasy world anyway. Um, and uh, others would say that it's kind of freaky. Um, but it kind of all falls into perhaps yesterday's as well, so we'll do a twofer. I live in Scotland. And Scotland is one of the most amazing places for lots of different reasons. And one of my most favourite, favourite places to be, and I don't go there often enough, is up on the west coast, Arasig and Malig. They have the most beautiful white beaches in Malig. It's a fishing town, not village anymore. It's a fishing town. And it has still the wildness about it. And of course, it's just a hop, skip and a jump over to Sky. The interesting thing is I have never been to Sky. There are a lot of places in Scotland that I have never been to yet. And the places that I want to go to are places that, when I see them, make my heart sing. So my fantasy Friday night would be a night when during the day Andrew has come back in home and has said to me, right, get a bag together, we're going, we're going off, we're going to Arasig, and then from Arasig we're going to Malig, and then we're going to Sky in the next day. And that would be just magical. And we'll take the drums and we'll take the ritual bag and we'll make ceremony on the beaches and we'll be grateful in the glens and magnificently magical in the mountains and we will just have a hell of a time. And do you know something? The reason that we would be having a hell of a time? Because Scotland is a hell of a place. It has something for everybody. There are great cities and great towns. And, you know, if you only go to Edinburgh, you're really missing the point. So, come and see us. Drop by. Come and have a wee cup of tea. I promise not to foist any haggis on you, but you might get a whiskey. <laughs>